Hi guys, my name is Trish Sylvester, fitness program manager from Portland PDX. We're going to do a little body burn workout today. So if you're able to, I would love for you to grab a lovely hand towel. Um, if you have any, some hand weights. You don't need them though. You can always use, um, let me be very specific. I'll just grab something, just something from your front room. You can grab whatever you like, okay? But what we're gonna first do is we're gonna start with our towel and we're gonna shake it over our head and we're just going to pull because we've probably either been sitting or laying down today or like in Portland we have some great weather so people are out and about. So let's just open up that rib cage, pulling it side to side, breathing in the nose, out the mouth and take it to the center and once again trish sylvester fitness program manager from planet granite pdx we're gonna go four more here just opening it up nice 30 minute workout today make sure you're breathing in the nose out the mouth i have a little bit of a knee injury so i won't be jumping too much today but i will be cueing you on when to jump last one hold it up and just open up those shoulders open up that chest and pull it down slightly into the back, press it up, bring it forward, bring it up, down to the back, squeeze those shoulder blades, bring it forward, bring it up, squeeze up, and squeeze, chest is up nice and high. We're going two more. And then we're gonna go with one more. We're gonna hold it here, and we're gonna pull our arms in and we're gonna hinge from the hips. I'm gonna turn sideways, so nice flat back. You can take the towel out, drop it to the floor, let your arms hang nice and flat and squeeze through the glutes and bring it up and take it back down, nice flat back, squeeze through the glutes and bring it up. We're gonna take it down three more times and bring it up and two more times and bring it up and one more time and bring it up. Now if you have enough space and you have like a mat, I want you to go down to the end. We're going to do some walkouts. You can still see me a little bit there. So let's hinge from the hips. Let's walk it out. We're gonna hold it here for four, three, two, one, and we're gonna walk it back. And we're gonna bring our arms up. We're gonna bring them back down and we're gonna walk it out again. Nice flat back. One, two, three, four, take it back, bring it up and bring it down. Three more, walking it out, hold it nice and flat. One, two, three, four, take it back, bring it up, take it down and out. One, two, three, four, inhale, exhale. Last one, bring it up, take it down, walking it out. Hold, five, four, three, two, knees down. And I want you to pull back into child's pose. So hips are back. This hurts my knee just a little bit. So I'm not gonna go back too far. And then we're gonna cross our arm underneath. And then we're gonna go to the other side. And we're gonna go back to center. I'd like for you to have a seat on the floor. So bring yourself around. Go ahead and grab your towel again if you're able, if it's close enough to you. Bring one foot in, towel comes down, wraps around that foot, pull yourself forward. Deep breath in the nose and exhale, pull yourself in. Inhale through the nose, exhale and release. Now let's go to the other side, same thing. One leg comes in, wrap it around that toe, bring it forward, deep inhale. Exhale out, one more time, inhale, and exhale. Hold it here for just a second, and we're going to release. Take your towel, hold it in half, set it to the side. Let's scooch down to the end, and we're gonna go right into a nice little bicycle crunch to get that core ready and engaged. So we have one, extend, two, extend, three, Extend, four, extend, five, extend, six, 
seven, three more, eight, nine, one more, exhale hard, 10, and bring it in, other side, extend and blow it out, one, exhale, two, exhale on the up, so exhale here, inhale, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, one more, and extend, bring it in, drop your hips open. We're gonna reach our palms to the ceiling, ready? Reach it up and hold for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down, hands above the head, supine stretch, nice and long. And pull it back in and reach it back up for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, above the head, supine stretch, point those toes, bring it back in and reach one more time. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and down. Bring it down, hands to your side. I want you to take your palms, face them inward, up to your shoulders, so tap one shoulder, Feet are flat, so your heels are driven into the ground. And I want you to take this hand like you're going to do a handshake across the room. And you're going to lift yourself up through that core. You're going to bring yourself down. Other hand comes up. Touch the other shoulder. Shake that hand across the room. And back down. And switch. Shake that hand up. That's three. Back down. Abs should feel nice and warm. Shake that hand up. Nice straight legs, coming down, switch, this is five, and up, shake that hand, bring it down, other side, and six, halfway through this, back down, we have two more on each side, up, shake that hand, bring it down, other side, up, bring it back down, Last one on each side, shake a nice strong hand and up, and then down slow, other side. Last one, up, shake that hand, bring it down slow, and arms out to the side. Go ahead and pull those feet in, heels down, and let's just windshield wipe side to side. Getting ready to get on those feet, get into that movement. We got two more on each side, one more on each side, and we're gonna hold it to one side, whichever side you land on, hold it there. Kicking that hip forward, and other side. Kick that hip forward, really pushing through that hip flexor and that psoas, so lifting through with a press, and then take it back to center. I want you to go into a nice little pretzel, circle the ankles, just super brief. Other side, pretzel, super brief, and then release. And then we're going to just drive ourselves up. We're going to flip ourselves over to the knees, nice flat back. Take your feet, you're going to jump in, drop that butt down nice and low, and drive it up. All right, so I'm going to reposition the camera just a little bit so you guys can see me on the mat. There we go. So let's start with mat walk downs. So when we do the mat walk down, what you want to do is you want to get to the edge of your mat. You want to put your hands out in front and we're just going to take baby steps all the way to the front of the mat. We're going to come down out into a nice clean plank. We're going to bring it up and we're going to walk it back. And that's one. Okay. So that's how you do the movement. We're going to do five rounds total. So what I want you to do is get nice and low in three, two, one, let's go, walking down low. Two, up to the top of your mat. When you get to the edge of your mat, hands go down. Jump back out to that plank. Jump those feet back in and walk it back. And that's one. Stand it up and squeeze, back down and go. Two, walking to the front of the mat. Taking it down, feet are out, feet are in. Walking it back. Stand it up, squeeze. Do it again, down. Number three, walking it up. 
Hands come down, feet go back, feet come in, walking it back. We got two more. Ready, squeeze, go. This is round four. Taking it down, hands come down, plank, back up, walking it back. We have one more, okay? Last one, low, walking it up, taking it down, feet come out, feet come in, walking it back, and squeeze. Good job, shake it out. Go ahead and grab your weight. If you have a surface to sit on, great. If you don't, you can remain standing, or if you want it to be a little bit more challenging, you can go to a single knee position. Hand is out in front, right hand with the weight. We're going up for eight, seven, six, five, chest up, four, three, two, one. Other side. Hand out, flex, and go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down. Grab your other weight. All right. So from seated position, or you can do it in a squat, your choice. We're going to drive it up, and we're going to swing. Bring it back down. Set it back down. Up. Press if you would like to add a press. Bring it back down. Just adding some little additions. But this is the basic. Back down, that's three. I'm gonna alternate just in case you wanna do the press. I'm doing it with you, that's four. We got four more. Curl. Back down. Up. Curl, press down, back down. Ready, up, just the curl, back down. Last one, we're gonna add that press in if you want to. Up, curl, press down, and back down. Good job. So go ahead and set those weights down. We're gonna stand to the end of our mat, okay? So, put on the ground it. Standing on the end of our mat. So, the right leg is my bad knee. Today, it's been a little weird to have a baker cyst, so it's a little harder for me to do lunges. So I'm gonna slightly demonstrate a lunge, making sure that your knee is lined up over your ankle, and I want you to bring it up. We're doing one side, and I'm gonna do it super cautious. Three, bringing it up. Four, all the way down. Back up. Five, back up six, back up, seven, back up, eight, and up. We're gonna go to the other side, ready? Let's go. One, back up, two, back up, three, back up, four, and up, five, and up, six, and up, seven, one more, and eight, and back up. All right, our last weighted move is we're gonna go into bent over rows. So I always kind of like to do a deadlift pickup with my weights. I love the feeling of my glutes. So what I would like for you to do is to either rotate your hands forward or turn your hands sideways, okay? So here we go. Hips are back. Let me turn sideways so you can see. Nice flat back. Chest is neutral to the floor. Eyes are gazing slightly above your nose. Now let's go. One, squeeze the shoulder blades. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more. 10 and relax. All right, round one, let's get some water. I'm gonna grab my water bottle. I hope everybody's enjoying this day wherever you're at. I hope it's as beautiful as ours is here in Portland. Um, we're gonna 
going to start from the top of that circuit again where we're walking down the mat. So if you want to make it a little bit more difficult, use your towel this time so that you can pull tension. So pulling tension means you're pulling on that towel. Okay, so pulling it, keeping that chest up nice and high. We're going to go back up and down five times. Because it's a towel, you can use it to the floor. If you want to use your weights, you can use your weights too. Just don't make the weights too heavy because holding your arms out for five rounds become a little bit much on the shoulders, okay? So let's set it down. Let's go. Walking, two, three, four, five, six. Kind of count your steps. Bring it back up. Walking, 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 walking. And this time when I squeeze, I'm bringing my arms above my head and then I'm bringing it back down. That's one. Let's go. Down. Pulling that towel. Keeping that tension, okay? We're going to go down. We're going to go out. We're going to go in. Hold that tension. Walk it back. Same thing. Nice extension above the head. Squeeze the back and the glutes. Bring it back down. Let's go. Round three. Up, nice and low. Walking, 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 walking. Set it down. Back. Up. Drop that butt. Walk it back. And we're going to go up to the top again. Squeeze. Bring it back down. We got two more. Okay, let's go. Down low. Down low. If you don't want to jump, I'm going to add lead here and just tap my foot back for those that don't want to jump down anymore, but then still walk back. Okay? Bring it up and squeeze. Back down. Let's go. Either one. Down or step backs. So from here, glute. Glute. And then walk it back. And then bring it up and bring it down. Good job, you guys. Let's make our way back over to our lovely couch and grab your weight, single weight. This time the hand is pointed up, so we're rotating that thumb externally out to the outside of your shoulder and really squeeze that core nice and tight. Are we ready? Let's go. Eight, palm is out, seven, Six, five, four, three, arm up, two, one, other side. Are we ready for it? Palm is up, thumb is rotated out. You should feel that really a lot in your, in your mid shoulders. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, bring it down. All right, both weights. So on this round, you can choose to stay seated and do the step, the stand up, or you can stand and do a squat. Same thing with the curl, alternating with the press. If you want to add the press in there, you don't have to, okay? So let's grab our weights. I'm going to try to do it this time standing. It's a little less pressure on my knee if I actually stand and do this. So as we're coming down, we want to slide the weights so they go down the sides of our legs. Are we ready? Kicking that hip back. We're down one. Bring it up. Curl. Press is an option. Ready? And two. Bring it up. Curl. Press is still an option. Ready? And down. That's just three. Curl. I'm going to press on one more. We're down. Bring it up. Curl. Now you can keep pressing or you can just do the curl. So I'm gonna curl with those that aren't pressing. Up, up, down, and drop, and curl, and down, and drop, and curl. One more, and drop, and curl, and down. Good job, you guys. All right, let's go ahead and set those down for just a second. How are we doing? We doing good? I probably should open my window, but then we'd hear all the outside sound. And then you wouldn't be able to hear me very well. So I'm gonna keep pushing it through. So we've walked up and down our mat. That was five times, which you did great. I'm sure you did, so give yourself a hand, okay? After the walk down and backs, what's really important is that when we sit or when we do the squat that we're really flexing that glute, because when we were in this position flexing that glute, 
that was setting us up for what we just did, okay? So right now, we're gonna go to the end of our mat, and once again, you can use your towel, or you can use your weight. Or, if you have one of these little guys, you can use phone call, I got a phone call, I had to decline it. So if you have one of these, try one of these, okay? So, I'm gonna do it with the band this time. I like these bands. Stick it on your arm. Are we ready? We're gonna hold it out, and we're going to lunge for one. Bring it up. For two. Bring it up. For three. Bring it up. And four. Bring it up. And five. Bring it up. And six. Bring it up. And seven. Bring it up. And eight. Bring it up and relax those shoulders for a second. We're gonna go on the other side. You're doing great. Are you ready for this? All right, other leg, extend. And another option you can do too is pull it out harder as you can and really work those medial delts. So instead of extending and getting some posterior, let's really focus on that medial if you wanna do a 90 degree hold. And let's do it, here we go. One, and up, and two, and up, and three, shoulders over the hips, and up. Try not to do this. Try not to lean forward, okay? Keep that head back. That's four, halfway through. Here we go. Five, back up, and six, back up, and seven, back up, one more, and eight, back up, and release. Good job, you guys. So on our rows, I'm gonna give you another option. So I have my short one like this. I have my band like this. And then I have uh, this little guy, this Fila thing. Who's on here? Who's talking to me? Uh, 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 uh. Hi, that's me. Yep, that's me doing all this. So three different kinds of bands instead of using your weights. So how this goes is you take this little guy and you stick it in your shoe, opposite foot, okay? And you can do it with any band that you have, okay? So we're gonna do single arm rows this time, or if you have your weights, you can do two hands. And for the time that it takes us to get through with both hands, you'll get through with two rounds. So are we ready for this? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one for good measure. Gives those guys a chance to get a break. We're gonna switch to the other side. Are we ready for it? Here we go. One, actually I'm gonna turn around this way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and release. Good job, you guys. All right, get some water. I'm gonna check my messages and see what's going on over here. I see some little windows popping up. You can talk to me if you want to. See, I have six people on there that are tuning in. Hi, how's it going? So, let's see. I'm gonna take you guys through one more round. Okay, but we're gonna add in a little extra. If you're doing good, you walk up to the camera, push a little thumbs up or a heart or something so I know you're with me. Is anybody from Portland with me? Where are we at? Who's working out today? Put your name in there. I wanna see who's here. Who's here? I wanna see. I'm gonna sign in for me. Just like we do in class, Trish is here, Singe, yep. And anybody else wanna sign in, please feel free. Ooh, that number just went from six to 11. So all 11 of you, sign in, yes. Let's, let's represent PDX, we got that? All right, so let's come on back over. So on this one, as we're walking up, we're going sideways this time, okay? So I wanna do some lateral movement, okay? We're gonna do some lateral movement. So what I would love for you guys to do is give yourself the best bear hug possible. I want you to set your hips back and I want you to scoot down 
the side of your mat. And I want you to go back up to your mat, all the way up. I want you to stand and I want you to reach right, reach left and back down. You can do a cross this time instead of a hug. Work in that lateral, okay? Lateral is really important. And then alternate which side you lift on. And let's go down to the end of the mat. Take it back up to the other end of the mat. And we're reaching and we're reaching and we're down again. Taking it down, step inside, working that lateral leg, getting it going. Reach, reach. We got one more. Walking it, talking it, taking it. Ooh, back. Two, three, and reach, and reach. And because we didn't do our squat thrust on the walk, we're gonna do our squat thrust solo. So this is a little extra cardio, okay? So when you're doing your squat thrust, make sure you're slightly bending those knees, falling into your knuckles or your palms. We're kicking those feet back. I purposely want you to drop your knees down, drop your chest, pick yourself up, back to your toes, underneath yourself, and stand up. So we're gonna break that down. It's like a, a burpee for me is going all the way to the floor, so this is really a modified burpee with the squat thrust, okay? So I really want you to focus on the drop. So we're gonna go five total. Are we ready? Here we go. So squat it down, jump it out, hold that plank. Drop the knees, pick up those feet. Push up, bring it back up. If you can't jump up, please walk your hands back, touch your hips, bring your foot forward, and stand up. Because everybody's different, so I wanna make sure that everybody has their modification, okay? That's one, let's go. Down, out, knees, push up. Up, jump in or stand up. That's two, let's go. Squat, plank, knees, push up. Up, plank, squat, boom, that's three. Two more, let's go. Squat, plank, knees, push up, up, plank. Guess what? We have one more, let's go. Squat, plank. Knees, push up, up, squat, and up, and good job. All right, we are moving on to our lovely squats. So, on this last round, you can do two things. Do it from the seated if you need to, otherwise we're going to add a deadlift, okay? So I'm coming a little closer so we can be on the same page. So this is what we're doing. I'll demonstrate it one time, okay? We have a squat, we stand, we deadlift, and we're up, okay? So squat, stand, deadlift, and squeeze. Are we ready? Eight total, here we go. There's eight, squeeze, deadlift, one, seven, squeeze, deadlift, two, down, up, Deadlift, squeeze those glutes hard, halfway through, deadlift, four more, down, up, deadlift, three more, squat, up, deadlift, two more, squat, up, deadlift, uno mas, squat, and down and up. So what did we leave out of that last one? We left out the curl and we left out the press. So guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna curl press. So let's do this, are we ready? Here we go. We have curl, press, down, that's one. Curl, press, down, we're almost there you guys. Curl, press, three, yep. Curl, press, four, four more. Curl, press, five, curl, press, six, curl, press, seven, last one, curl, press, eight, and down, yes. All right, so for our lunges, go ahead and put your weights down. We're gonna put our weights down. I'm gonna use my towel, my face is sweaty. Woo, 
pits I have. All right, so this time on our lunges, I would like for you to hold it for a little bit longer, okay? So we're gonna hold it and we're gonna come to standing, okay? And when we come to standing, we're gonna squat out to the side, okay? So it looks like this. We're gonna go down, we're gonna bring our foot up, we're gonna squat, we're gonna bring it in. We're gonna go down, we're gonna go up, we're gonna go squat and bring it in, okay? We got eight on each side, we're rounding it out, you got this. Are you ready? Let's go. So we have lunge, balance if you can, squat, and that's one. Down, balance, squat, that's two. Down, squat, that's three. Hold it just a little bit longer. Up, halfway through, yes, let's go. Down, up, squat, that's five. Booty should be nice and warm. Down, up, that is six. We got two more, ready? Let's go. Down, hold it. Up, squat, one more on this side. My leg is on fire, let's go. Down, up, squat, and that's eight. Good job, you guys. Guess what? We're not done yet. We have to do the other side. So I'm gonna turn around so you can see me. Are we ready for it? I'm just gonna do it this way and that way. All right, let's go. Set, take it back. Hold it a little bit longer. Bring it up, squat together. Bring it down, bring it up, squat. That's two. Bring it down, up, squat, three. Bring it down, up, squat, four. Halfway, there, squat. Ooh, my butt's on fire, let's go. Down, up, guess what? Two more, down, up, squat, one more, down, up, squat, and bring it up, and good job, yes. So, what we're gonna finish up with is our rows, okay? So I wanna try something different for the rows. So, as I pick my weights up here and there, I'm coming around, our rows are going to alternate, okay? So right side, left side, both. Just to tidy it up a bit, okay? So turning it sideways, rest those weights on the quads, and we have one, we have two, we have three, and that's one, other side. One, two, three, and that's two. One, two, three, and that's three. One, two, three, and that's four. One, two, three, and that's five. One, two, three, and that's six. One, two, three, and that's eight. And then one, two, for good measure, up and down and squeeze. Yes! I think I messed up on my counting there. We either did an extra one or we did this perfect. I'm just so hot and distracted with how hot it is in here right now. Get water. We're not quite done yet. My water's over here. So I'm gonna drink some. All right, you guys. So hopefully you're feeling that in full capacity. Anybody talking to me yet? Let me see. I have my glasses on. Hi, Corey. Thank you for watching from Maryland. I love it. Hi, Hapreet. I hope you're not just watching, you're doing it with us. All right, you guys. So, let's cool it down. Bring that heart rate down, okay? So I want you to act like there's something up here and you're gonna push it way down. So we're gonna take a big breath up and we're gonna blow it out. Big breath up and push it out. Big breath up 
and push it out. Big breath up and push it out. Two more up and push it out and up and press it out. All right, I want you to make your way to the floor. All right, we're gonna go down, we're gonna finish up with some floor work. So I want you guys to do some lovely planks with me. So what I would like, if you can, if you're super sweaty, grab your towel. And we're just gonna do some planks. I'm gonna grab my timer. Okay, hopefully you can still see me. I think you can, all right. So what I would like is to do a modification of this because we're gonna do a little bit of extra. So feet off the floor, abs are tight. Are we ready? Set and hold. Whew. Whew. It's hot in here. It's a nice 68 degrees in Portland, Oregon. Abs are nice and tight. Getting ready for a transition in five, four, three, two. Right leg out. Squeeze just that leg. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Bring that foot back in. Extend the left and hold for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Bring it back down. Adjust and up with both. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. And lower yourself down. Extend the arms above the head, and we're gonna alternate right side to the left leg, left leg to the right, up, bring it down, up, bring it down, squeeze, squeeze, two more, there's one, last one, there's two, down, palms by your armpits, take a deep breath, and push yourself back. And I want your hands just a little bit wider than hips, and I want you to push your hips side to side. <sighs> Chins towards the chest. And three, two, elbows down, and draw back into your hips. So that upper back should feel like it's closing in just a little bit. And then we're gonna push out, and we're gonna lower ourselves down. And we're gonna reach over. You guys did great today. And we're gonna let it go. And we're gonna reach over. It's my bad side. Hard for me to reach. And then we're down. And I want you to roll over to your back. Then I want you to pull your right knee into your chest and just circle that ankle both directions and then switch you guys are awesome and then extend nice supine stretch and so this time when we come up I would like for you to come up in a nice slow hollow body so super hollow chin to chest rolling up rolling up rolling up rolling up and pressing out Yep, showing my F10 t-shirt from the back. And then we're gonna swing it around. And we're going to cross our feet. And we're gonna reach up. Whew. I hope you guys have been enjoying these workouts. We miss you at the gym. It's nice to be able to still connect and bring these to you. Five, four, Three, bring it down. Slight straddle in the front. Let's just walk those elbows out. Deep breath in the nose, out the mouth. Walk it over to the right side. Take it over to the left. All right, awkward silence. Take your hands, circle your wrist, both directions. And if you have what I have, which is 
this really nice sunny day, I would love for you to go take the next 15 minutes and go for a walk, if you're allowed, if you're allowed, to leave your dwelling, go for a walk outside. If you have stairs, I have like 17 stairs at my place, I'll walk up and down the stairs just to get my legs moving. So I hope to see you guys soon. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, please rewatch the video if you wanna do the workout again. It's super simple and you killed it. And we appreciate you. Go Planet Granite. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.